and say, oh, see, now, we, now we're going to use Ukraine. Well, what was and, Adam look, Schiff what, saying and, yesterday? I mean, Adam Schiff, <laughs> the chairman of your committee now, yeah. came up with his own version of events and his own, you know, uh, download of what the president said to the Ukraine president. Let's listen to that. I got to get your reaction. Here it is. OK. All right. This is the essence of what the president communicates. We've been very good to your country, very good. No other country has done as much as we have. But you know what? I don't see much reciprocity here. I hear what you want. I have a favor I want from you, though. And I'm going to say this only seven times, so you better listen good. I want you to make up dirt on my political opponent, understand lots of it, on this and on that. So was that all made up? Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. Uh, I, when I was I was sitting there, I, I don't know. I couldn't see the screen, but but my colleagues and I kept listening to that, and that went on and on. You only played a short part of that. That went on for about a minute, minute and a half. But it, it's and not I, what was in the transcript, though. Is what I'm saying. It's not real. It's, it's fabricated. It's fabricated. So it's not real. It's not what was said. And so, and then later, I'm sitting there looking at my colleagues. We're going, wait, wait, what, what's going on? And then, and then later, after we called him on it and said, that's not what was in the phone call. That is not what was in the transcript. Uh, he comes back later and says, oh, it was a parody. Well, only in the Democrats' fantasy lands is that parody. This is, this is a serious issue. They want to impeach the president of the United States. They're accusing him of, of crimes. And then you fabricate nonsense. Okay, that's what they did yesterday. That was, that was all nonsense, what you just played. It, yeah. None of that happened. And then you come back and say, once you get busted on it, you say, oh, it's just parody. Oh, let's laugh about it. No, Unbelievable. Uh, nobody's laughing. Uh, this is not funny. Was there uh, and this was is there causing, wrongdoing? This is causing major, major problems in, in, this, in, in, in this country. I want to get back to the wrongdoing and where there was wrongdoing. Did Joe Biden do anything wrong? <laughs> well, that needs to be investigated. So, you know, we've also so, you know, it's not just President Trump that's been trying to get information from Ukraine. We have too. we have long wanted to know who were Fusion GPS's sources. OK, so we've been trying to track that information down. Uh, there's been some reporters who have been out there trying to get this information for for the last year or so. Uh, and that's John Solomon, who's, who's been on your on your show yes. before. He's done a he, he's done a great job of looking into Ukraine. Yes, he Which, has. This ought to this ought to tell some people a, a lot. OK, when he's breaking this news, you've got the Republicans looking to try to find this information as what are the origins of the Russia probe? You've got some reporters, a few, not very many, you and a few others covering this. Now, all of a sudden, this, this gets concocted about Ukraine. Nobody wanted to know about Ukraine before. Remember, Ukraine were the good guys. Yeah. Russia was the bad guys. Now you've got that. Now, if you believe they're, they're in their, they're only in their fantasy land, could they turn around and say, oh, well, now Trump actually favors the Ukrainians, not Putin. Unbelievable. Okay, the mainstream media didn't want to know anything about Ukraine. Now they want to know everything about Ukraine. So, so look, this is, this is a joke, uh, but it's a serious one. It's a serious joke. Is this there's going lots of to affect the president? Is is the president going to be forced from office in your view? And what do you think viewers and voters are going to take away from this whole thing? Because, you know, you just connected the dots for me. And it was really important that all of the, the, the beginning, the origins of the Russia probe started in Ukraine. That is such a big, important point, And I'm glad you made right. it. Is the president in any jeopardy? No, because look, the reason he was in jeopardy last time is because they ran an information warfare campaign. You had dirty cops at the FBI, right, who actually had an FBI investigation going into the president of the United States based on information the Democrats gave them. This time, at least, we've got adults over at the DOJ and FBI. So there's not an investigation going on. OK, so you've got the Congress, the Democrats in Congress yeah. who are using this to feed their never ending impeachment impeachment appetite. Remember, right. they went out and poisoned the American people. They've got their base poisoned on this. That's right. So much so that they have to keep throwing out, pouring jet fuel on their base to keep money coming in. Unbelievable. Uh, and so, I mean, that's what's really going on here. And Marie. real quick before you go, when is the mm -hmm. IG?